very close. We do all the usual things together, birthdays, holidays, vacations. But when I was sick, I, I didn't want to do anything. All of a sudden, I was tired, very tired. I'd go to work, come home, I, you know, I gotta go to sleep. I lost a lot of weight and uh, maybe 30 pounds. And they put me through many um, tests and workups. And she was found to have fluid around her lungs and around her heart, which led to rheumatology consultation and subsequently diagnosis of lupus. Lupus is an autoimmune disease where the immune system becomes dysregulated and starts attacking its own organs. It can affect any organ system, skin, can affect joints, heart, lungs, kidneys, brain, so basically anything you can think about. So lupus is like any other autoimmune disease, it lives with you, it lives in you. There is no cure for it, however, with the advancement in research, um, we are able to control it with medications. So Susan was immediately placed on medications that suppress the immune system and stops the inflammation. Shortly after that, started feeling better. Doing good, no complaints. She's great, she right. takes very good care of me. I see her every six months, but every three months I have blood work. Our visits are routine because I haven't had any flares. She's very thorough. She looks at the lupus, but she looks at my other systems, of course, because you know you can't really separate that. Not all patients with lupus are the same. They don't all act the same. They're very different. It is so diverse to the point we call it great masquerader. It can mimic anything. It can mimic a viral infection or viral syndrome. It can affect non-specific symptoms. It can affect early cancer symptoms. Treatment plan and approach should be personalized patient by patient. Dr. Ohab is very generous in her personality. She always asks me about my family or the grandkids because she knows that we have a slew of them. Every time I see her in clinic, she always tells me, I'm back to myself and I forget that I have lupus. That is so gratifying to hear. I feel pretty healthy even though I have, you know, chronic illness. I just live my life the way everybody else does. And of course, it's so especially great since I retired because now, you know, every day is Saturday. <laughs>